So let's go up to Yankee Stadium in New York right now to the Madison Broadcast booth and analyst uh, Mike Bordick. Mike, when you see that pitching matchup, Miley versus Tanaka, what stands out to you? Well, it's going to be a tough uh, battle, obviously, for the Oriole offense. Tanaka's had an up-and-down season, but when he's on, he, he's a swing-and-miss pitcher. He's got a nasty slider, but it's a split finger. That's his bread-and-butter pitch. And he, uh, one of the tops in swing, swing and misses, actually, on that pitch. So the Orioles are going to have to zone him up. They're going to have to be selective, and they're not going to have to try to do too much. If they get over-anxious, he will take advantage of the Oriole offense. They've got to go the other way, back that slider up, elevate the pitch up in the zone, and then go to work. They need to pick up some home runs as well. Only four on this road trip, and they've scuffled offensively. So uh, taking advantage of the long ball is going to be big for the Orioles offense. And, of course, uh, you know, stringing some hits together. My goodness, the Orioles offense has been scuffling here recently. So uh, they got to start putting up some crooked numbers. Or well, Mike, when you look back at 12 runs in the last seven games, obviously that's a very low number. But... Can you just turn it on that way? I mean, obviously, it's very difficult for hitters to just uh, suddenly turn things around. Well, you know, they have to trust, obviously, what they've done this season. They're coming off one of their best months in, in the history uh, of the Orioles franchise. So this team certainly has the capability. It's about trusting each other, you know, not trying to take the weight of the team on your own hands and trying to hit that grand slam every time you step up to the plate. It's about stringing hits together. It's about being patient. It's about trusting their game plan. And that's the most most important thing they have actually been pitched to I think here on this uh, losing stretch and you know they're just not making adjustments right now if they want to have success against Tanaka they've got to make in-game adjustments and elevate their strike zone wait out mistakes Tanaka's given up 30 home runs so yeah he's got some swing and miss pitches but he makes a ton of mistakes too and if they're not patient they won't get those mistakes